OMG, what? Follow E, OMG, who? Follow E, OMG, yeah, follow E, who that be? Hell, that be me. Follow E, what's up? OMG, follow E, gang, 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 gang. What's going on out there in YouTube world today, baby? Well, today, y'all, we are going to do my famous shrimp and grits okay y'all that's what we gonna do today so we gonna get started but i'd like to thank all the mothers the fathers aunties grandparents anybody that's taking care of kids providing for kids getting them the things that they need not always what they want i want to tell you i appreciate you i adore you and i thank you so much for all that you do okay let's get started okay what i have on the stove right now is I have a skillet that's on the stove that has butter on it, okay? has It's melting right now, so I have it on low. I also have a pot with, cream, with um, chicken broth and heavy whipping cream. So you're going to need this for your grits. So chicken broth and heavy whipping cream, okay? So we're going to get started with this. Let's get the grits on, okay? And we're gonna use some five minute, just, just some quick cooking grits right here, okay? And we're gonna do about a cup and a half, okay? We're gonna pour in here. Let me bring y'all over here so y'all can see what's going on. So we got that to a bowl. And all we need to do is add our grits, okay? So we're gonna do about a cup and a half in this here. And we're gonna pour a little, stir a little, pour a little, stir a little, okay? And y'all do to the amount that y'all are making, I'm going by the amount that I'm making, okay? All right. So I'm doing about two cups, actually. And this really gonna cook itself. Actually, we just don't want it to stick. We kind of want to stir it up and let it do what it do, baby. Let it do what it do. Okay, y'all, this is gonna be some creamy, delicious grits when we get through, okay? All right. So let's get over here. And what we have in here is we have one whole bell pepper, yellow and orange, we have a whole onion, and we have about five, six cloves of garlic, and we have um, a whole um, three jalapeno peppers without the seed. If, and that is optional. You do not have to use it. You do not have to use it. I want to kind of turn this heat up a little bit over here on the stove before we get into fixing it. So I'm putting about a stick and a half of butter due to my amount that I'm doing. And while that, before we put this on, while that's melting, what we're going to do is go ahead and season the shrimp. We already cleaned and divined it, so all we have to do is season it now. So the only thing we're going to use is garlic powder. Okay. And we're going to use some onion powder. Let me show you. Garlic. We're going to use some onion powder. Let me stir my grits up a little bit. To get the popping everywhere. If you don't pay no attention a little bit. Hold on, y'all. Okay, so that's onion powder, garlic powder, and we're going to use a little bit of salt. This is salt, just a little bit. I don't want to use too much. A little couple of sprinkles everywhere. And some black pepper, black pepper, okay? I love my black pepper. Mm-hmm. 
that's it y'all i'm gonna mix it up and that's all you need <coughs> my season i got some season i got some bring y'all over here Let that get caught up. Let me tend to these grits right now. Because it don't take long for them to cook. It's gonna be creamy, y'all. Let me get the cheese out too. While that's going, And we're going to let that simmer really slow since we I have to work on this side right here. Okay, y'all. So the grits cook itself. Y'all see all that flavor that's going up in here. So while that is sauteing, we're going to go ahead and add us some sausage. This can be cooking right there with this. And we're gonna add the shrimp last. This is a quick meal. If you prep your vegetables, clean your shrimp and do all that, it won't take long at all to fix this meal. See, this is all we gonna do. Just let this really fry up a little bit, saute down a little bit, and baby, what you say? Add those shrimp into that, and baby, we gonna have some toppings to go on top of these grits. I'm here to tell y'all. I'm gonna get a bowl for it too. Get that out. And have that ready. Okay. We definitely don't want this to get soggy. We still want to have a little crunch to it, but we want to saute it very well, okay? Nice. Just want to saute it very nicely. Let's go over here and look at our, our grits. And everything is done. I'm going to add in a half a stick of butter to the grits.
Let's get that good and melt it down up in here. See how creamy looking those grits are? They are creamy. Okay. Now you can use Parmesan. You can use whatever cheese your heart desire. I'm going to use some mild cheddar cheese of mine. Get about a good cup. A hand and a half. That'll work. I love cheese grits. Okay. The grits are done. The grits are done. Completely done. Let's get back over here to this side. And you see how that deliciousness, ness, ness, ness look? Look at that deliciousness. And the last thing you want to do in here is you want to add your shrimp. So we're going to open this up a little bit. And we're going to throw our shrimp up in here. Look at them shrimp. Look at them shrimp. We just need these to turn pink. And it's done. Want to make sure they stay good and tinned up. Look at how beautiful those shrimps starting to look, baby. Get them down there at the bottom so they can go ahead and cook. And this will be over with. Easy breezy dinner. Easy breezy dinner. Y'all, there's one more little thing that I want to add in here at the end. We're going to add a little bit of Old Bay seasoning at the end right here. Not a lot. Just a little bit. And if you don't want to use Old Bay, you can always use Cajun seasoning. It's good too. Turn this off and baby waffle. Y'all, did y'all see how fast and easy that was? Did y'all see how fast and easy it was? So let me fix y'all a bowl right quick.
delicious looking. Okay. Okay. That's my thumbnail. <laughs> All righty, y'all, let's get a taste. I'm gonna have to let y'all go. Oh, this is the bomb.com. Okay. I want y'all to like, subscribe, hit that bell button, comment down below, and come back following. OMG, what? Follow E. OMG, who? Follow E. OMG, yeah, follow E. Who that be? Hell, that be me. Peace.